Frank Stewart with FreemasonInformation.com, Symbols and Symbolism. In this episode, we examine the symbol of the beehive, a symbol that Mackey in his Encyclopedia of Freemasonry says was among the Egyptians that it was a symbol of an obedient people because, as he quotes Harapolo, of all the insects, the bee alone had a king, something we now know to be a queen. Mackey continues, hence looking at the regulated labor of these insects, when congregated in their hive, it is not surprising that a beehive should be deemed an appropriate emblem of systemized industry. Freemasonry has therefore adopted the beehive as a symbol of industry, a virtue taught in the instructions, which says that a master mason works that he may receive wages the better to support himself and family and contribute to the relief of a worthy distressed brother, his widows and orphans. In the old charges, which tell us that all masons shall work honestly on working days, that they may live creditably on holidays, there seems, however, to be a more recondite meaning connected with this symbol. The Ark has already been shown to have been an emblem common to Freemasonry and the ancient mysteries as a symbol of regeneration, of the second birth from death to life. Now, in the mysteries, a hive was a type of ark. Hence, says Farber, in The Origin of Pagan Idolatry, both the Deluvian priestess and the regenerated souls were called bees. Hence, bees were feigned to be produced from the carcass of a cow, which also symbolized the ark. And hence, as the great father was esteemed an infernal god, honey was much used both in funeral rites and in the mystery.